you're buying a house. How many days should you expect to get from contract to close? That's what we're talking about today, and we're starting right now. <music> Welcome to Thursday Thoughts. I'm Sherry Ann Green with Coldwell Banker. This is our Thursday Thoughts series where every week I address an issue about the buying or the selling process or the real estate market in DC and Northern Virginia. This week we're going to talk about how many days from the ratification of your contract to purchase a house until the day that you get the keys and you can move in. The process can take as long as 45 days, but it can take as short as 14. Let's start with the longest timeline and move our way down to the shortest. Let's say you're doing a Veterans Administration loan. They're shortly called a VA loan. Those typically take 45 or 40 days on the shorter side. Let's say you're doing a conventional loan. Those typically close in 30 days. However, there could be a way for you to close faster and there could be a reason that you need to close faster. If you are in a multiple offer situation, which is happening a lot in DC and Virginia right now, you may need to offer the seller a shorter time frame to close. Why, you may ask? The seller may be ready to move on, may be ready to move faster, or if the seller has already moved out, they may want to stop paying carrying costs. Those are taxes, utility bills, and any of the other expenses that come with carrying a home. If you can show that seller that you can get them out of the house that they are departing faster, it may help your offer. If all the other terms of the contract are similar to the one you're competing with or the multiple offers you're competing with, if you can show that you can close faster, you may be the winner. How do we get you a shorter close? We work with your lender ahead of time. While you're in escrow, the lenders have to get you completely underwritten as well as the house or the condo that you are buying. However, if we work with your lender ahead of time, they can ask you for all the paperwork that they're gonna need to underwrite you up front. By the time the lender is writing that pre-approval letter, you have already been through the underwriting process as a person. All they're doing once you're under contract with the house is doing the appraisal and getting that through underwriting and checking any of the condo or HOA documents if you're buying inside a building or an association. The shortest time frame that we can usually get you closed is if you are paying cash. If you are paying cash, we can close you in as short as two weeks. We just need enough time for the title company to do all the proper title work and get the buyer paperwork and the seller paperwork ready to go. If you like this video, why don't you watch this one next? It's all about the seller disclosures. What do they have to tell you when you're buying their house? That's our Thursday thought. Make sure you don't miss a video. Click subscribe.